up, y'all? It's Nomi's coming at you with a little bit of Boondock Season 3, Episode 7. Pause. Uh, Rana. Siraj. Pat. Nubby. Spidey. Marqueta. Chris. Mickey. This episode's about dogs. What? This episode's about dogs? Like dogs. Uh, I mean, pause. 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 We like Oh, my up. God. No, that took me way too long to figure out. <laughs> But yeah, can I pet that dog? Can I pet that dog? Can I pet that that's a bear. Stay yeah, every time I see a bear in can a video, I can I pet that dog? Oh, it's like the first <laughs> comment every time. <laughs> that video has made bears more adorable. Can I pet that dog? Yes. Can I pet that dog? Well, oh. am I the only one that has no idea? I have no idea. Can I pet that dog? I saw it the first time in Mexico, bro. It blew my mind. Can I pet that dog? Right there. I thought it was a TikTok. Yeah, like is it a TikTok? I don't know, but it sounds like a TikTok. Quiet and turn it up. You cannot pay that dog. No, no. You cannot pay that dog. You cannot pay that dog. What? You cannot pay that dog. You cannot pay that dog. You cannot pay that dog. Now I get it. I hope that kid goes far. It's those like skinny little bear, and the mom is like, "It's, it's bear, honey." <laughs> we got we got Surge and Pat to join our collective brain cells. I love it. you guys. We're in it. No, they no. Speaking of collective brain cells. Yep. This is Nar Marcus. Substitute. Please support the original content. Hit that like and subscribe button. Thank you for being here. There's a Patreon. There's a Twitch. There's social media. Check it out. Participate in polls. Participate in the polls. Yes. So. You know, it's kind of cool that there's only four seasons of this. It's just like, so when shows go on too long, then you like forget. You can like binge it in like a day. Which episodes are good. That's fair that you can remember. It was like, yeah, yeah, those nuggets from each of them. Oh, oh yeah. A Ty Perry? Yes, Ty Perry. He's my new friend. Does that mean he. Hey, Jamal. Yes, my Dukes. Oh, my Dukes. <laughs> they already made Father Tyler Perry one episode, didn't they? Jesse. Not enough. He's a good Christian <laughs> with benefits. Shoot, girl, why didn't you say so? You man. Oh. <laughs> you know, I didn't check the expiration date on it. I ain't lying. <laughs> what is <laughs> happening? Oh, you guys yeah. know Medea used to be plays before it was movies. Yeah. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh, my I God. I didn't know yeah. that. Winston Jerome is holding an open casting call for the leading man in this new play, and I am preparing for my audition. No oh, shit, shit, Gramps. Your granddad was once a passionate, dedicated Oh, my God. Kid. Oh, another backstory. Long before the days of Terrence Howard. <laughs> 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 didn't have room for a young, handsome, light-skinned black man with good hair in those days. Terrence Howard the first? They called me Mr. Grimps. Aww. <laughs> Oh! 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 God. Bro. Rock, rock, oh no! What is happening? Mr. T. Mr. T. Thank you for the opportunity. Oh! He's looking for mature men. 50 and older. Must look nice, Good shirtless, hand. and not allergic to baby oil. Whoa! <laughs> Those are so highly specific. I say do it before it's too late, and it's gonna be too late real soon. <laughs> Might as well. Give that man everything I got. Pause. Pause what? You said some gay, so you gotta say no homo. <laughs> <laughs> you say you, how I know you not a homo, granddad, if you don't say no homo? <laughs> Stop calling your granddaddy a homo. Then say no homo. I'm a homo your ass. You. <laughs> 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 uh, Typical. You oh. Oh. You start with a professional black woman trapped in a troubled marriage with a brown-skinned bald dude from Law and Order. Yep. <laughs> Get out. I'm gonna marry this white pussy. This white pussy. White pussy. My dude who looks like Shimon Moore shows up and just got out of jail. Oh, Excuse yeah. me. Uh, may I rake your lead? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she gets the norm and sees a sensitive side. I never thought I'd ever be with a man so loving and light skinned. <laughs> <laughs> just when the brown skinned dude from Law and Order was about to Why? <laughs> we gotta watch that real mad black woman. Mm -hmm. Law and Order. Having found true love through Jesus. Okay. Okay. <laughs> you. My dear, with a weapon for no reason. I didn't think there'll be this many people here just for a play. But if we like you in the play, and you in the movie or the play, you get you on the TV spinoff or the movie or the play. Mr. Damn, mommy. He would. You won't be needing that shirt. 
Jesus told me in my next play, Marduk should find herself a man. So I've decided to call this play, Marduk finds herself a man. <laughs> <laughs> Lotion! <laughs> no lotion! <laughs> Bro, how many lotion you got? Sunrise orange, minty mango, and apple. Sunrise orange sounds good. Oh, minty mango. Is there a I'm gonna try the minty mango. Uh, who's this actor? Okay. Minty mango it is. Is that Charlie? <laughs> Turn around. <laughs> you want me to pop these bumps? <laughs> uh, <laughs> what? No! <laughs> Okay. Well, I'm off. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. That's it! <laughs> Seriously? What does Tyler Perry think of these? Oh, he hates it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I asked Jesus, will you co write with me? And he said yes. I mean, that's not wrong. Right, Jesus? Then I asked Jesus, how can I further spread your message on earth? And he said, cross dressing. <laughs> <laughs> I have built an empire, and I will crush ice Damn. and my supremacy of black Hollywood. <laughs> 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 uh, get on your knees, Robert. Oh, no. Oh, no. On your knees, Robert. Oh, you Robert. <laughs> Do you accept me as the representative of Jesus Christ in the TV and what? movie business? Mm. Is he really this religious? Cube and all his I words. Well, you know, no. No. <laughs> <laughs> Friday was his favorite. Pride. Pride. Is that a Star Wars reference? That was evil. Uh, <laughs> what? The the Jesus Jesus what? Does... Bro, so that's bro. how all the Medea titles are come up with. Jesus, <laughs> Jesus comes and tells Tyler Perry. Really? <laughs> Have a family reunion. <laughs> I just think he's the best. That's what people need more of. Positive entertainment. I don't know, man. The one movie you guys showed me was pretty wild. <laughs> Who's the lucky leading lady? Well, they haven't cast her yet. Uh, Probably, uh, maybe Halle Berry. <laughs> you know, somebody hot. Is that Winston Jerome guy in a dress? You're playing Ma Dukes' boyfriend? <laughs> There's no love scene. Granddad's gonna need to have no homo tattooed on his face. <laughs> <laughs> Cat Williams at a field day with this. Right. Yeah. They gonna make you wear a dress. <laughs> I never wore a dress. I think it's gay. Do wear dress. Look at this man called Jesus doesn't love you. <laughs> 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 what? Sure. Have to do with any sure. Sure. The uh, the Atlanta not. episode also goes hard. Yes. Mm -hmm. That was yes. hilarious. Hello, Robert. Very well. We're oh, so man. glad you decided to join us. Why is it so dark here? Bloomberg Gambino's in Whiteface. <laughs> no, there's a different one. Okay. <laughs> We're so glad you joined our crew. Right. <laughs> Welcome. Where it all goes. What was the, uh, yep. Yeah. I hadn't seen that movie when Frank I saw it. Yep. Yeah. Rocky Horror. Yeah. Yeah. It sounds like it. Jesus on our scene. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's all right to cross the Christ. To make plays and dress like women. Let's do the time. Let's do the time. Yeah. Yeah. Cry to cross the <laughs> <laughs> that in the place? Yeah. We just did that for fun. Oh. Uh, let me show you the compound. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> let me show you the compound. <laughs> now let me show you where you'll be staying. You'll live here at the compound during the run of the play. Tyler Perry doesn't have a compound, does he? Yeah. He does. He does? He does. He does. This is real? Yeah. Tyler Perry Studios? Yeah. What? We must remove Bro. all distractions. Or just my grandkids. Hey, boys. We were just wondering how late rehearsal was going to go. Well, uh, I'm not coming home for a while, so don't wait up. Praise Jesus. <laughs> Praise Jesus. Granddad. Yeah, spam trouble. over there. Mm -hmm. The first day of rehearsals for Ma Dukes finds herself a man. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Jesus, you are a wonderful savior. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> 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 yeah, talking about my Man, look at these broads in here. Amen. Yes, amen. Hallelujah. 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 He's not thinking about Jesus. He's about big titties. Why does that look like a Jerome for nearly ten you years? Your well, family must be very proud. Yeah. Honey, I, I don't love talk Jesus. To my family yeah. anymore. Oh, I will no. give me some Kool Aid. Oh, you oh, drinking no. the Kool Aid? This is my first Winston Jerome project, but I've been in the business for almost twelve years. Anything I might have seen was in Do the Tight Thing. Oh, oh, I don't oh, yeah. do the right thing. Nah, she's oh, a porn star. The last film was Six Dicks of Separation. All that time I was giving up the ass for me, 
Now I only give up the ass for Jesus. Oh, God. <laughs> Praise Jesus in the name of Jesus. <laughs> oh, God. I had the sweater put on him because he just looks so cold up there. How did you get it on? I love Jesus. Do you, you look love so cold Jesus up there? Oh, yes, they I love sewed it onto him. Yeah, that was, <laughs> right? there's no way, there was no other way you could get that on. Well, it appears we love him. <laughs> <laughs> Women we had the cameras the there. That's real. That was in the, the episode. <laughs> the face. If women <laughs> apples and orange. Jesus and I will deliver. What? Any kind you want. I want some of them uh, Alicia Keys and cover them Beyonce. Something <laughs> sad. Look like Linda Carter. <laughs> <laughs> like a Wonder Woman. But you must oh, give boy. yourself to Jesus first, Robert. And to me. You must choose, Robert, between your old life and your new <laughs> one. Look, please don't call me again. This is my family now. No. Granddad's in a cult. A cult. That's gay. <laughs> See everything gay. That's gay. Well, at least I have Jesus and the strong love of oh, an so independent bad. black woman. This isn't working. I work with Jesus. <laughs> Jesus is trying to tell me something. Hold on. Oh, no. Jesus says the scene would have more impact if you grabbed the Maul Dukes and kissed her deep on the lips. <laughs> Pause. Change it in the script. Praise Do it, Granddad. <laughs> Do it, Granddad. Think about the tatas. There was no ambiguity at all. <laughs> Chapstick. I totally understand your concern. But Jesus wants us to be actors first and heterosexuals. <laughs> <laughs> when I go on stage, Jesus wants me to become her. So nervous. And a woman's desires. Ooh. Oh, no. Oh, they're gonna see this just in time. They're gonna save him just in time. Classic Huey oh, Riley. Oh, wow. Right. How? What? <laughs> Huey? <laughs> you know where I could find Robert Freeman? Just walk in the path of Jesus. You'll find him. <laughs> <laughs> this lady here. Wait, Jake, can I get in there? Y'all remind me of my grandsons, but they like Ice Cube movies, so I can't <laughs> speak to them. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm gonna get me Stop some it with your clothes. Oh, no. What is this? A cult it's a man. cult man. All I need. Ah, God, God. <laughs> Oh, they got a theme playing. Chop, chop, chop. Oh! Oh! Did you think you could just take him? Snap out of it. Damn it. <laughs> just sidesteps. <laughs> I know it's a homoerotic Christian theater cult, but if it gets me in Hollywood, who cares? But this is my fear factor. Mount Dukes is my monkey testicle. <laughs> my, this is my monkey testicle. <laughs> get home, go in my clean underwear drawer. There should be two hundred thousand quarters. That should be enough to get you through the week. <laughs> That's the most quarters? grandpa thing ever. He's not gonna go through with it. Yeah. That tongue coming out was too strange. <laughs> oh. 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 oh shit. Okay. Wow. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, I have found my cutie pie, my dupe. Oh no, they're laughing. Well, at least I have Jesus and the love of a strong black African black independent black woman. <laughs> Kiss me, my dupe. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> okay. That wasn't too bad. Yeah, make your money. And now it's time for me to get my big prize. Groupies. Groupies. <laughs> Oh, sugar. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Oh, God. What? Mr. Jerome would like to Jesus see you. Jesus Christ. Hello. Uh, hello. It's like an anime shot. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus and I were so pleased. Don't give me that bullshit. <laughs> this is the big prize. I can get a big bitch on my own. And all I get is the mud ducks up there. Oh, oh, yeah. What the fuck? Oh. I've just sold Marduk finds herself a man as a movie. Guess who's my leading man? I'm gonna be in a movie. Yeah. And I only oh, have man. one request. Sex scene. Look, man, all bullshit aside. Can I please just have some ass? <laughs> Wait, okay. Tell me you made up this whole cross dressing Christian cock crap just so you can sleep with yes. me. Yes. Uh, pretty much, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
Okay. <laughs> no homo. <laughs> yeah, Tyler Perry doesn't like this shit. <laughs> you could have just. Oh my god. Pause again. Pause again. Oh my god. Pause again. He's like, look, man, for a You never heard nobody call the fucking mud duck? <laughs> he dropped all pretenses and asked for some ass. Why? No, I have not heard of that before. Mud duck. I don't know what to do. What's the truth about You guys are confusing me. Can we please just have sex, please? You want to know if Tyler Perry's actually gay? I don't know. No, I'm hearing mixed reviews on the couch. Ladies. No, he's not. I mean, we don't, no one knows, but you always hear stories about. I've never Perry ever heard gay. anything in my life. The compound. man's career started out with him being a crossdresser. Of course, everyone was going to think he was gay. Uh-huh. Yeah, I mm-hmm. think it's just easy to say when people crossdress. It's like, oh, they're gay, but the mm-hmm. idea is like that's not really yeah. true. Yeah. So the mm-hmm. first instant it is, I mean, that's going to be like now we're knowing more about it. So. He's not. He has a wife. Like he might like like people love cross dressing. He's also a billionaire. As well. He's, He's the billionaire. Uh, yeah. He could have an ass if he wants to. Who <laughs> else that is? We like, could when. Well, first off, don't nobody know what anybody do behind closed doors. Yeah. Also, nobody gives a shit. Fuck who you want. As long as it's consensual, y'all exactly. adults don't even give a fuck. What? But what we found out while doing uh, we were doing independent movies on the Movie Club podcast and Pat. This light shone down from heaven and Pat was like, Tyler Perry is the most successful independent movie maker of all times. So we we're like. For real? And he was like, yes. Yeah, yeah. Very 100% technically, we will be watching okay. Medea Goes to Jail for Independent Movie Month. I used to watch all the Medea movies. He knew. Interesting. Yeah. Pat's keyed in. Nice. <laughs> I mean, yeah, look, one billion you. Damn. Yeah, once he, like Tyler Perry Studios is huge. There's been a lot of movies. House shot of Pain there. is really good, man. And yeah, imagine he, how much money he's saving on his movies. He, yeah, it's yeah. all in on his house. TV man, shows. Like he also <laughs> like he he gives jobs to a lot of black people, um, black yeah. people well, in Atlanta. He's like, a lot of black workers, PAs, cameramen, That's assistants. Kind of, like he he is actually a supplier of many jobs in the film industry in Atlanta. Yeah. yeah. And it's well known. I mean, yeah, for sure. Now, if we want to talk about but it is the funny goodness of all the movies, that's a conversation yeah, for the, the another actual quality. Time. The yeah. Atlanta episode yeah. is hilarious. Hey, honestly, I, I think I've movies. seen like two Medea movies, and I can't remember honestly other Med- like Tyler Perry stuff. But I I enjoyed that when I was younger. I never seen any of the Medeas. Oh, for real, oh, man, bro, you gotta watch the one. He, that go he to was jail in a, he was in an assassin movie with Jack Shepard. Yeah, I, I remember that. One. <laughs> that He's Howard? also in. Um, He's in Paw Patrol. What's he in? Oh, Gone That's Girl. He's the lawyer in Gone Girl. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. I haven't seen Medea movies, but I have seen other Tyler stuff. Uh, Tyler <laughs> Those were just stuff. called Bro. Like that, that How could you not have? He's put out so much stuff. He's like put that. Out so much. His yeah. entire yeah. filmography is super I crazy. I don't think I've not seen a single thing. I'm trying to figure Madea out which Medea one I've seen, but I don't remember. Stuff. Um, so is that house thing? Is that a real? The like compound? Let's Google it. I don't House of Pain? It no, has been house. portrayed in no, two different Tyler parody Perry's Tyler Perry. Oh yeah, he has a big ass seen. studio in uh, Georgia. Mm-hmm. That's all I know. The, the no, security house, cameras house is house. real. That that is a real thing. That's something Donald Glover said he heard that was there. Yeah, they're like watching you at all times. <laughs> he just thinks maybe it's Tyler Perry. They're just watching. He doesn't have a compound that he lives at, but he does have a big old wow. studio. Wow. Hey man, but that's all. Wow. Oh, so like you can't be hating on that. Yeah, it's kind of wild though. He did. The I feel like shoot. he is independent, but also like he's a billionaire now. He's just the studio. Yeah. Like he, there's no more independence. Yeah. Right? He's a you, thing. You can't be at the top. The <laughs> studio one <went there>? day. <laughs> like he had his own studio. But like like he's going against like big time studios, and like compared to them, he's still small. Oh, I, that I, looks I, I like that's the right. one. Yeah. That's is that that's his house. That right? is a very small, that's, humble that's, yeah. abode. Yeah. yeah. So All it right. seemed like it was this mixed with the other studio in the yeah. back. Like they combined it two. I want a house like that to be like. No, park your car at the front, time. walk to my house, I'll see you in 30 minutes. <laughs> but, salt burn when you, you can You can make that front lawn like a par three. Mm-mm-mm. But uh, yeah, the Tyler Perry is super successful mm-hmm. and putting on for people. But, you know, what about the episode? What do you guys think? Uh, putting also, on people's butt, is that what you said? It was putting, uh, on, people. putting on people. Oh, okay. <laughs> putting people episode. on, comma, but. Gotcha. It was funny. Yeah. yeah. Perhaps a touch in Jesus. A touch homophobic. It's just so funny how many times Granddad has left the kids. He's like, "Yeah, you guys will be on your own." Like they almost starved last time. Yeah. yeah. There is the big thing, like you know, I did mention Cat Williams for a reason. There is that thing where people say they're they're trying to make black people dress wear dresses and things the like that. The of the black male. And it's like, oh, mm-hmm. that's like the Illuminati, or it's they they want you to do that. And uh, I don't know because 
You had Robin it's Williams not. play Mrs. Doubtfire. And then you had Martin Lawrence, the yeah, big Martin mama. Lawrence, big mama. But like, oh, I feel there's like all comedians, all actors, Shakespearean actors mm-hmm. dressed up as women yeah. back yeah. then. Yeah, there's yeah. Uh, before the women Martin Lawrence brothers did it. <laughs> there's a whole the women. entire thing about like leading men, leading white men that have all worn dresses. It's a comedy thing. Mm-hmm. And I mean, there's a lot of conspiracy theories about it. I'm sure the comments are going to be fucking crazy on this one. But also, yeah. like, I mean, you don't, no one's going to make you wear a dress. If you sign up for a role that has a dress in it, you could be like, oh, I don't want to do that role. Mm-hmm. And that's fine. I don't know. Mm-hmm. It's kind of up to you. It also, like, I feel like you're giving a dress a lot of fucking power. Motherfuckers yeah. halfway around the world be wearing things that people would consider to be dresses. And it's just the clothes that they wear yeah. over theirs. Yeah. It's a whole thing. I think that's a crazy thing. Like, because even the outfits, like, clothing has become non neutral gender. Because when Harry Styles wore a dress to one of the red carpet, mm. everybody was like, oh my God, what is he doing? It was like, but it's a fashion icon at the same time. Like, because you can wear clothing however you want. It's just like, mm-hmm. oh, because you're wearing a dress, now you're gay. It's like, that's not mm-hmm. how it works. That is how it works. You wear the dress. Uh, and you start sucking dick immediately. Yeah, Put a dress yeah, on yeah. and poof, it's in your mouth. It's like, that's it. It just happens to be. It like, the man walks no, up to the fun. door and he says, ah, I see you put on the dress. I'm here like, for the dick. Yeah, you're cross-dressing or you're doing drag or whatever. It's like, you just, it's like, no, those are whole, like, they're no. all, they're separate own thing, things. Separate things. Like, you can't combine them and there's yeah. not only one label. Like, no. Yeah. But, yeah. No, fashion is, fashion is vastly changed. Yeah. For, so me, for guys, the male, we, female. We all see Shit's Creek. Like, David is always wearing, really? like, a skirt kind of type of mm-hmm. thing. And I love that, like, mm-hmm. outfit. So Here's yeah, my question. Good. If you say something that can be perceived as gay, do you say no homo after? Do you say no. pause? Or do you just let it run? I've been saying let pause more think. and I've been watching that Shit's and Gigs podcast <laughs> because they say pause yeah. caught a bit. I was like, oh, pause. But otherwise, Ironically, I don't though. You what? Right. Ironically. Yeah. Ironically. Yeah. Oh, no, I mean, back I back when that phrase first started coming out, yeah. maybe. I haven't I mean, said it in so Not in the last, long. like, ten years. Yeah. <laughs> it's kind of like saying, like, that's what she said. Like, if it happens, yeah. nobody says it huh. unless you are Mike, Michael. Like, but. Lil Wayne used to say it sometimes. sometimes oh, sometimes. Lil Wayne used to say it all the time. I always thought that it was something that, like, <laughs> this sounds stupid. I always felt like it is something that gay people could say because you are telling me something that you wanted to say that was, like, straight. You know what I mean? Like, if you were just like, hey, like, not trying to, like, I don't want to, I want, you guys, I don't even know how to really explain it. I know what like, you mean. Like, like, I think I know what you're trying to say. Yeah, like, like, no homo. Like, someone, yeah. Just yeah. clarifying. No like, your gay friends, like, I really like your hair, but like, no homo. You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. And like, because, like, nice everyone, we all <laughs> know that I'm straight. So, like, if I, I don't have to turn the homo off of the sentence I said, like, <laughs> <laughs> it's still a straight sentence. Like, I don't, I never yeah. got it. So. There's this one trick that heterosexual men hate. But that's funny. I've only heard straight men. Yeah. Say it. Yeah. Because it's like, oh, yeah, like so that's a great I'm outfit. Really no homo, though. It's like you can be got a compliment and not be like flirty <laughs> yeah. on it. I mean, but. it's it's all in like rooted in homophobia. Mm-hmm. I like yeah. it. Sure, but I'm not gay. You just want to like, immediately <laughs> proclaim that you're not homo. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And even with the old. Um, things back in the day the old propaganda that they made about gay people a lot of it was like about like the secret gays like oh your neighbor he's 40 and he doesn't have any kids and he lives alone oh he's a secret gay watch out for him so like the that whole gay. built in <laughs> deep into the homophobia of America Riley is like just say no homo man like if you don't say it then I don't know you're not it's homo. like Riley you know it meant a lot to me that you said no homo going back well Riley's a child Riley's yeah. a child I, Riley's hilarious though yeah. What are you looking up about that? Like, eh. When his uh. granddad slapped him. No, he said, ow. I do like that Huey slept granddad and granddad slept the shit out of him. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Three stages of shit. That was fucking hilarious. <laughs> I know. Oh Poor Riley. <laughs> I mean, why would he like slap the shit out of him? It was really hard. Granddad's face moved. <laughs> and he came right back with that huge ass swing. He thought oh, he was God, in a cult. Was he was trying crazy. to knock him out of it. Yeah. I mean, yeah, they were being good ki- grandkids. Do you renounce all Ice Cube movies? <laughs> yeah, you know. In all his works. I kind of like Friday. I like like Friday. 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 <laughs> Are we there yet? Every yeah, time they make a Friday reference, I don't know why. It's always the funniest That's shit. That's so funny. I love the Rocky Horror Picture Show, sir. Like, I had never seen Rocky, Rocky Horror Picture Show when I saw this scene so I didn't know but like after seeing the movie that's hilarious that's funny I think it's also like that he (laughs) they're just making fun of the fact that he's not out with it like finally at the end he was just like 
Look, man, can I get some masks? <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> you said that from the beginning, man. It would have been way better. I don't know, maybe. I can't believe he went all the way out for that for just granddad. Well, <laughs> go and lose whole Jesus cult thing just to like get away with being gay. Like, <laughs> just be gay. Just be gay. Um, and I do I appreciate the the Rocky Horror Picture reference, but also I think the Rise My Apprentice was definitely a Star Wars reference. <laughs> rise, and he was like, Rise! He had the lightning going off in the background. <laughs> I, I like it. I, I like a little something. Yeah, I like so, a little. Too, Pat, too would you wear a dress or kiss a man if you were gonna get famous and get big? If I got, if I got, yep, if I it's get money. It's just acting. Hell yeah, it's acting. There it's we go. just arts. It's literally arts. Well, I got a skit for you. No. <laughs> <laughs> Are you getting into you Hollywood? Promise, you promised me Beyonce. Are you getting into Hollywood? You, are, no. you, you promised, promised me Beyonce. Beyonce. Is that a promise someone can... I promise you Beyonce. <laughs> <laughs> She's in the back waiting right now. As soon as you kiss another man, Beyonce's coming out Yo, here Beyonce right now. Yo, Beyonce looked hot. At did she did at the Super Bowl? Oh, my God. It could, it could be, I promise you, comma, Beyonce. And, like, Beyonce is, like, a code word for, like, you know, like, yeah, like right. keep it, like keep it one hundred. <laughs> <laughs> all right, y'all. Well, we got uh, one more episode to do in this binge, so we'll check mm. that out. And we'll see y'all there. Bye. 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 Thank you so much for watching Boondocks with the Normans. Uh, Uncle Rock is here telling you to subscribe to their Patreon. It's a good use of your money. And um, you know, we got a shout out to Joe Max, Pavi Lucas, and Martin Dagsvall. Uh, we'll see you next week from all this Boondocks.